Viewer discretion is advised. They have guns. They have guns. Intersection. There he goes. Oh, my God. Oh, 1050 right in front of us. Nope. He, sh he just shot the dude. Nope, 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 nope. Gun, 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 gun. And continue. Whoa. He just 1050 his police car right there. What is happening here? <laughs> got a dog, got a dog, got a dog, got a dog, got a dog. That's what you get, bro. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5. My name is Jeff Faviano, and this is LSPDFR. A very happy Wednesday to all of you guys. And we are going to be doing a Sheriff Patrol here in Sandy Shores with the Ford Explorer. Now, it was kind of weird getting the uh, handling line uh, to work on this. I had to basically just copy the one uh, from Police 3 that I had edited for the Police 3 slot for the LAPD unit or LSPD and uh, move that to the FBI 2 slot is what it's called. If you were wondering, if you can't find that handling line, it's the FBI too. So we just spun around right here. This uh, Explorer was just recently updated. Be sure to go out and get the newest version of it. Uh, we're going to be using the high priority callouts today. So we're not going to respond to that. That one right there is just a uh, a normal LSPDFR one. So we're going to ignore it. So we'll, uh, we'll basically do some uh, traffic enforcement and the high priority callouts and, you know, check some ANPRs and whatnot. So let's get out here today and see what we can come across. We have a traffic alert uh -oh. on um, Algonquin Boulevard. All right, Algonquin, Algonquin Boulevard Algonquin. right here in this area. So it's going to be a possible wanted vehicle. Armed for or wanted for a recently armed robbery. That's interesting. We're going to spin around here and try to meet up with them. Looks like they're on that outer dirt road. Headed down here towards uh, Sandy Shores. They might be making a left turn now onto this little road. If that's the case, then we're going to kind of just wait for them. Yep, they're coming right down here towards us. So we'll pull over and just kind of be inconspicuous here. If, see which way they're going to go. They're going to go east on Joshua. So we're going to try to catch up to them really fast and uh, light them up. Get some uh, backup involved, I'm sure. It's going to be a... Uh, Attention. This is dispatch. Yep, target Approach felon. Let's uh, run their license plate. Since they're sitting right here, why not? Okay, they're making a left here. No turn signal there. So that gives us a reason to pull them over. Um, I'm going to go ahead and line them up right here, actually. And they are not listening Target yet. There they go. All right, cool. Zero seven, Queen, William, right. Edward, six, eight, zero, no, 1099. All right, so let's uh, let's get some uh, local code threes. Shoot, I always forget to do that. I need to step out of the vehicle first before I do that. So I just want to make sure we have code. They are not listening. They're just going to continue up further. Let's try pulling them over one more time. Come on. And they're going to take off. Okay. Well, never mind. We're going to be in a uh, pursuit now with that subject. I was kind of wondering why they weren't going to pull over, and now we know. And now we do know. So we're going to be involved in this. Let's go ahead and try to get a state unit involved. Ooh, man. They almost lost control of their car there. So I rolled back to an older version of the physics mod. So hopefully we don't have those issues with traffic acting ridiculous. I'm hoping. Man, this guy's really starting to get up and go, isn't he? Move that vehicle out of the way. All right. Yeah, nobody's responding yet. So let's try to get two locals involved here. In the uh, Alamo Sea. Oh, he just lost control. Or he's going to get out. He's going to get out of the vehicle right there. Yep. We're out of the vehicle. And they have weapons. They do have weapons. Okay, watch out. Nope. Put it down. Put it down. Put it down. Put it down. Put the knife down. Oh, shit. Come on. Come on. Get, get on the ground. Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Hide. Take this lady out over here. Hang on a second. Where is my code three backup? Like, seriously? Drive in the Alamo We got a hit on her there. I'm going to wait for backup to arrive here to help out with this mess. All right, there they are right there. Now, I know I could have just shot her and, f and ended it, but a lot of you guys really want to see more better shootouts, so I was going to wait for backup to get on scene. All right, let's go ahead and take put this lady in custody. The other one wanted to die, so... There you have it. She's going to be uh, in custody. Rose Hammer. Let's go ahead and look her up. Rose Hammer. Rose Hammer. 
There we go. Okay, we stand her up. And uh, she had an expired license and no active warrants. It looks like she was the driver. I couldn't really, really tell. So we'll be charging her with that as well. Um, all right, cool. So let's let's just clean this up. We'll put her in the back of the uh, of the utility. Get, the car, get this shut. off the road, and we're gonna search their vehicle. Call the corner down here. Hopefully, uh, we can get this scene cleaned up as soon as possible here. So we will call a uh, transport unit in for her. And then we can conduct our search on this vehicle. Actually, we will go ahead and call the corner down here to pick uh, up this body. And let's see if they had anything going on over here on this side. Anything going on besides uh, what we already knew. You never know. Nothing of interest there. We'll check the trunk. I mean, if they're involved in a robbery, we want to see if they... Uh, Oh, there she is, dead against the door. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, they're picking them out. Open alcohol and a scale. That's that's legit. All right, search this side. Then we can tow this thing, and get it out of here. Nice. All right, call is code four, and the tow truck is on scene, so we will be uh, code four as well, and we'll be ten eight. All units. Units what the heck? On Stolen Hill motorbike Road. on Joshua Hill Road. Not sure which way they're going to be going. Looks like they're going to be going the opposite lane. So, yeah, they're going to be heading west, it looks like, on that outer dirt road. Whoa, Coyote. Okay, we're going to try to parallel them right now, and then uh, we'll see if we can get uh, meet up with them at the very end up here. So let's try to get a state patrol unit. That'll be another uh, motorcycle involved in the pursuit. So, motorcycle on a motorcycle would be a good idea, I think. I believe so. So, we'll be converging with them very shortly. Patriotic bike uh, is what we're looking for here. And looks like it's right up here. Yes, it is. All right, cool. So, we're going to be in pursuit of this guy. Looks like it's a white male. You got to be kidding. It's Mr. Dildo, I have a feeling. Mr. Dildo. Once again... Watch out up here. Got to turn our uh, phaser on. Clear the intersection. We're all right. It looks like he's headed towards Los Santos, but you never know. Come on, cars all the way. Oh, come on. Whenever you uh, use the siren, uh, you really, really give up your left thumbstick. When you're trying to use your siren correctly. But that's okay. We're going to lose too much here. All right. So I don't think... Backup is going to be showing up anytime soon on this guy. Let's try one more time to get a state unit up here. On, uh, Road in the Redwood Lights track. Redwood's li Redwood Lights track. This guy is kind of all over the place, isn't he so far? Yes, he is. All right. Whoa, 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 people. I don't know what that was, but they were crossing our lanes. So maybe that is not, hasn't been fixed by changing out that uh, version of the physics mod, unfortunately. What you gonna do? Move these cars out of the way. All right, let's let notify LSPD that we got some stuff going on. I was not trying to do a traffic stop, but okay, thanks. Let's just keep on rolling this way. Here comes our uh, bike unit. We're gonna relieve that position to him. And we'll follow him. So LSPD knows about it. They, we should have an LSPD black and white getting involved up here. And we do right there in front of those vehicles. All right, dude, which way are you going? Nope, it's a sheriff unit. Let's uh, let the black and whites know that we need their assistance. Do you need my assistance? Do you need my assistance? And be right up here, looks like. Whoa, buddy. You look at that mini map for three seconds and you could, it could be the end of your life. Okay, watch out for this unit here. Not sure what he's doing. He doesn't even know what he's doing. We got multiple agencies. Oh no, our bike unit has been taken out. So it looks like uh, we'll have a. Oh whoa! <laughs> I, don't know where, I don't know where he was going, but wow. These are those terrible taxis. All right, come on, man. Let's let. I want to see some LSPD units involved. 
Might be one up here, actually. Yep, looks like it. And they're just all crashing into each other. Let's watch out here. Okay, just watching our position here. Let's watch this intersection. Still with this dude. He's up here. Man, you do not want the LSPD up here. Let me tell you that right now, buddy. You oh, there it was. That's what happens. That's what happens. Stop running. Stop running. Stop running. Oh, there's no way. We got a whole lot of units right here. Yep, they just tased him. Yeah, he is done. He is done. All right, cool. Going in for the arrest on him now. Get down, dildo man. Good lord. All right. Whew. All right, we, there. That's gonna be a code four situation there. Let's go ahead and pick him up. Put him in the back of our car so we can get uh, get, moving. get uh, LSPD to come pick him up. Hold on, guys. Just wait a minute. We'll run his name and everything else. Really just going to run into a white car? Just ran right into that white car. So Luke Angelo is his name. Let's look him up. Luke Angelo. Luke Angelo. See what Luke is up to tonight. Shall we? Yes, I think so. Valid and uh, he had no warrants, but... We'll just have LSPD come pick him up. Take him to jail. All right, so that guy's going to be taking Luke out of here. So we're going to flip around and we'll be 10-7 back to Sandy Shores. We're going to flip around on this uh, silver SUV. Kind of cross lanes right in front of me, and uh, we're going to see if he's going to be continuing to... Okay, he's just making another right turn now. Whoa, what is going on here? Now we got to figure out which one we want. Well, everybody's drunk, aren't they? Okay, this guy is definitely very, very strange. Yeah, well, we got to occupy times three just behaving weird and... We're going to stop him here in just a few moments as soon as we can try to make sense of this ring around the Rosies. All right, dude. Enough is enough. Pull it over right here. All the way over to the side before the intersection, please. No, not there. Okay, not there. Let's go ahead and tell them where we want them to go. Hold on. People, just wait a minute. All right, we're going to have him follow us up this way. Hopefully it'll be okay. Get him off the road here. Well, actually, have him pull down this dirt road so everybody's safe. Just up here. This will be fine right here. Yep. Hold T. There we go. We got him off the road at least, so that's good news. Let me occupy times three. Let's see what these guys are up to. I'm not really sure myself. Spotlight him on here. There we go. And uh, we'll get out, make contact with the driver. Uh, how you doing tonight? Let's see what the heck they were doing. We'll be nice to them right now. Howdy. Howdy. You guys, uh, let's see. If, let's question them, see if they've been drinking tonight. You guys been uh, drinking tonight? They say no. Okay, so that's okay. We'll ask them if they've done any illegal drugs. They don't have to answer that. That's true. Okay, that's fine. Uh, you got ID on you, sir? So we're just going to basically uh, check them out, see if Jason Mart has anything on him. They're just kind of all very weird looking people. <laughs> very strange acting. Okay. Jason Mart. Jason Mart. See if anything comes back on him. I am going to breathalyze him. Oh, he's got a 99 for the LSPD, so... He does have a 99. We're going to ask for an additional code 2 unit to get down here. Backup required. Because we are going to pull him out of the vehicle. Uh, and now that he has a warrant, we're going to be able to... Units respond code two. We're going to ask him if he's been drinking. All right, so you don't mind uh, just blowing on this thing here real fast? Let's see if he's been drinking and see if he's been lying to us. Yeah, he's been drinking, so he did lie to us, but he's, you know, under the limit. No big deal. 
All right, let's go ahead and ask him to leave the vehicle. All right. Don't need that thing out. My God. All, all right. You are under arrest. On, um, Got a warrant for you. So all go ahead and down on the ground. Down on the ground, please. All right, cool. All right, very nice. And we're going to go in and arrest him. Uh, and since we have him in custody, we are going... Actually, let's go ahead and... Uh, We'll make him stand up, put him in the back of the vehicle, and then we're going to deal with these guys. We're going to probably detain them, check their information, see if there's anything in the car, you know, all that good stuff. Down you go. Just get in the goddamn car. Here, get in the car. All right, let's uh, let's get this lady out for next. You have to use a gun to do this. I'm sorry, but you do. Don't make me kill you. All right. No. Nope. Come here. Sonora yep. Road. I'm going to detain you, ma'am, for my safety and yours. Let's go ahead and uh, let's get this over with. So, yeah, we're going to detain her. She's not going to be in trouble or anything. We're just going to detain her. So we don't have to worry about that. So let's uh, go ahead and stand her up. And we're going to walk her this way. Amber Black is her name. So we're going to set her down. All right, here's fine. Just sit right here for me. Amber Black. Let's look her information up. Amber Black. And try to do some police in here. She's still a valid uh, 27. No 99. Okay, that's good. Let's, let's just set her down right here if it'll let us. No way. You set down right here for me? Come on. No? Okay. Just hang out right there. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. Alright, cool. Well... Let's get this guy out of the car as well. Not, don't need that gun out. Out of the car, man. See those hands right now. All right, let's go ahead and spin around. You guys are detained right now until we can find out what else is going on. The driver has a warrant, so he's going to jail for that, regardless. Try my hand at poli actual policing here. My actual policing. We'll see what we get out of it. You never know. All right, Tassin Chowdhury. Tassin Chowdhury. Very name. Great name. The scene, Chow Hurry. Interesting. He has a, okay, so he has an expired license, but he doesn't have any warrants or anything. So both of you guys just come over here, away from the vehicle. Yep, place in the back for right now. Hop in. That's just wrong. Yep, right there. Go ahead and sit down. One, one of you guys need to get sit down. Car, there we go. Shut. Okay, she's going to be in the back of the car. This guy's going to just sit out here. And we're going to go ahead and search the vehicle. All right. So, let's uh, search this side first. Let's see anything, anything out of this traffic stop. Nothing of interest there. Let's check the trunk. Citizens report a Grand Theft Auto in progress. And the Redwood Lights track. See if we can get anything here. Nothing of interest. And we'll check this side. I mean, you never know. So those two are, they're perfectly fine, but we are going to take Jason downtown tonight. And nothing of interest there. And uh, we'll check the hood. Might as well. See if they hit any drugs in the engine compartment or anything. <laughs> I doubt it. All right, so the car was clean. We got a couple of these guys detained. Uh, Jason's going to go to jail. So let's go ahead and actually let's get him out of the vehicle. All right, so what we do is we're going to hit uh, six to release all, everybody, and then we're going to we're going to get Jason. Gracias. Nope, no, no, no. That didn't work out so well. Okay. Go ahead. Spin around, sir. I, I wanted to release them, but. I'm trying to figure out how to do this. I've never had to deal with more than one person on my own, so... This is new to me. So we're going to arrest him. He is going to jail. We're going to call a transport unit for him. Changes his name. No big deal. Backup required on Sonora Road. Respond code 2. Victor 13. We're at the little coffee shop around the corner. Roger. All right, cool. Let's try to get this guy... Get these guys set up here. Get them in the back of the vehicle so we can uh, let them be on their way. I'm really hoping they'll just get in the car and, and, and drive off, but that's probably not going to happen, I would imagine. 
goddamn car. Let's get in the car. All right, let's see if we can release these guys. Yes, we can. Okay, so we'll hit six to release uh, Tassin. He's good to go. He's not under arrest. And now we can release the other girl. So they're both free to go on their way. We're going to tow the vehicle. I don't think she's going to drive it out of here. She had an expired license anyway. We have a traffic alert. We'll call for a tow truck down here. Hop up on top of there. There you have it. So, yeah, they didn't have anything in the car. They were, you know, they weren't. He, the driver lied to me. He was drinking. He had a warrant. He's going to jail for the warrant. Okay, the tow truck picked up the car. We're going to be uh, code four off of this and uh, 10 8. So the uh, driver's going to jail for the warrant. He lied to us. He was drinking. It wasn't a big deal. He wasn't drunk or anything. And we let his two friends go on their way. Okay, we're getting an NPR hit of a wanted vehicle in the area. Looks like it's going to be right down the road, headed right towards us. So we're going to be sitting here nice and quiet. They're coming right to us, so we don't want to spook them too bad. And uh, we'll stop that vehicle. Let's go ahead and actually turn our lights on now. They're coming right to us. Let's see if they're going to head south or they're going to go north. Looks like they're going to go north. Okay, they're going to go north. Let's move that car out of the way so we can catch up. We're going to make a left here on 68. And we'll perform a traffic stop on them. Attention. Here we are. It's a carbon is I'm going to get them stopped right up here. Hopefully they pull over for us. And they are going to. Okay. Not happy with that spot, so we're going to tell them to pull over all the way to the side of the road. Hold on. Let's do that. Control T. There we go. Follow me this way, please. Make it a legit traffic stop here. There we go. Okay. They're no longer following us. Now we can get behind them correctly. Yay. And we'll see what's going on with them tonight. Turn our spotlight on them here. And uh, we're going to call for a code. Uh, we're going to call for a code three backup unit, actually. We've Just one. Come out with our gun. Grande, Sonora, Let's talk to them. Nope. Three. In your car. In your car, please. In your car, please. Whoa. Stop. Stop. Put the knife down. Put the knife down. Put the knife down. You little shit. You're still alive? He's not anymore. Dude, put the knife down. All right. He's running from us. Nope. Put it away. Let me get my stun gun out here. There you go. Yep. Right here. Right in the crotch. All right, man. Giving up now? Yeah, of course you're going to give up now. Good Lord. Had a knife and the, his buddy had a weapon. It was ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Well, thank you for the code three backup. I'm going to go ahead and place him under arrest. And we'll take him down to the station ourselves. Bob Mathers. All right, let's look him up. Bob Mathers. And he had a 99. So there you have it. ANPR did not lie. Put in the back of our car. Actually, before we do that, I do want to test to make sure. Wow. That, that sheriff is stuck in the hood. I want to see if the uh, frisking thing works that I have set up. Nope, it doesn't. I, I still have not been able to get that vehicle uh, car, or that ped search mod to work. I just have not yet. It's very weird. All right, let's just search the vehicle really quick. Get it off the road. This unit's going to be stuck here since that guy's stuck in there. So we are going to, after we're done here checking the car, we're going to um, just let them handle the vehicle and call the tow truck and everything else. Another vehicle's registration. There you have it. This is some bad dudes we're getting off the road tonight. All right, we found nothing of interest. We're going to leave the vehicle to these guys. We're going to take uh, this guy down. Bob's going to jail, so let's go ahead and do that. 
and we'll uh we'll take him down to the down to the big house Okay, we have arrived at his final destination, which is jail. Whoa. Yeah, they just, uh, he came out with a knife, but his buddy came out with a gun and started shooting at us, and I wanted to deal with him one at a time. And, uh, we were able to get him, uh, cuffed, and now he goes to jail, but his buddy had to die, and the coroner's gonna cl clean up that mess. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. We saw a little bit of uh, action, had a little bit of pursuit action. We had some, uh, we had to discharge our firearm a couple times, and we tr tried our hand at policing. But I really need to try to get that frisking mod going so I can actually frisk peds. If uh, any of you know how to actually get that working, let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you guys on Friday. Take care.